Hello everyone, you are watching new movie tech. Welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show you guys how you can play Silent Hill the original version on PC. So this is a PlayStation 2 game. So let's start how we can play this on PC. So first you have to download the PC stream later. Open your browser and search PCSX2. And this is the first link, it will be the official link of PCSX2. Okay, after you open the website, you can see here is a stable version, let's stable. Click on that. You can download the installer file or, and you can also download the portable file. So I will download the portable file because it's easy to install. Just extract and play. And you can also download for Linux and Mac OS. So open. Now let's extract it. I'll extract it here. Okay. Now open the folder. Now open the pc62qt.exe. Okay. Select default. And this will be the BIOS location of the pc62. Now we have to download and put the BIOS in that directory. A C drive users uh, document pc62 BIOS. So I'll not tell you that uh, why you can get the BIOS. Just go to Google and search pieces to BIOS and you will find the required file. Okay, I'll replace that BIOS files. Just click on refresh and select from there. Just select the Japan version. Click on next. Now we have to add the game directory. Uh, e games will be my game directory click on next okay now here you can connect your controller and click on auto map to auto map your uh, controller controls but in my case i am using keyboard so i will click on keyboard and automatic mapping so click on next and finish so wait for a while it will scan the game directory folder after successfully scan, it finds three games, uh, and those are the uh, PlayStation 2 games, as you can see, Bending the Alien Force, Metal Gear Solid 2, and the Silent Hill 2, which we want to play. You can download the game uh, from Google. I don't share the link with you guys because uh, it's not follow the community guideline of YouTube, so I don't share with you guys. But you can join my Discord server for links uh, of those games. Okay, now go to settings, then click on graphic settings. From here, uh, select the graphics to DirectX 11, and the adapter will be your graphics card. I'll select my graphics card, and yeah, click on it, close. Now open the game, double click on it, and it will boot the game. Click on full screen. Okay, let me key map first. I don't know what's the key map controller. Okay, from here you can change uh, the key maps. Okay, let's. Uh... James, honey, did something happen to you? Oh. After we got separated in that long Game hallway? Are Let you me... confusing me with someone else? Okay. <laughs> you were always so forgetful. Remember that time in the hotel? Maria? You said you took everything. But you forgot that videotape we made. I wonder if it's still there. How do you know about that? Okay, my key mapping is finished. Let's open the game again. The game is running at 30 FPS, as you can see.
okay new game match story no double click to full screen i guess yeah If you have any problem then comment down I'll help you and yeah I'll catch you in my next video bye bye